again YouTube it's Christina and I have decided today to do a look from Braxton Family Values it is a look that Tracy Braxton did and I think it was episode 5 it was a bluish greenish purplish look and I just loved it so much because it was very bright and fresh and I believe that it'll be great for the summertime so if you guys want to keep watching then do so thank you alright first I'm gonna start out with priming my eyes now, I didn't use foundation today. I just put on some light moisturizer and I concealed underneath my eyes and a few dark spots that I have on my face from freckles. This is not as easy as it looks. And this is my very first tutorial. Let's see how close I end up getting to you guys today. Okay, so the first color that I'm going to start out with is Fresh Water by MAC. It's my favorite like go-to blue color and I really like using this like in the summertime. It's so it's so incredibly beautiful. So I'm going to use one of my brushes. Get a little product on there. And I know it'll look a little scary. But that's okay. I'm going to do this like to half. half the lid. I'm gonna use a little mirror down here too just to make sure that I'm doing it right. Yeah. Put some of it a little too much on there. And the reason I didn't do foundation or anything else is because I didn't know how long this tutorial was gonna take. And since it's my first one, I'm gonna try and keep it 10 minutes or under. So now we've got the blue on. Let me do the other eye real quick. And we will be good to go. Ooh, that one's like way brighter. I don't know why, but it is. So I'm just gonna put a little bit more. And also with this, I am going to apply another color to the blue on top of it to give it more of a, like an oceany blue-green effect. So, so far we just have the fresh water on. Okay, and then the next color is going to be this flip side color, flip side by Urban Decay. Wow, that like changed colors on my thing, didn't it? I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna use the same brush and just apply this right on top. I'm gonna lighten it up and give it more of that Caribbean ocean blue look. I didn't have a color that was in between these two, so I figured that I would just mix them. This is not an easy tutorial to do on my iPhone. No, it isn't. Oh well. Okay, let me get some Q-tips so I can clean up a little bit. And then later I'm going to do a little blue-green. Like his liner and then a black liner. I like this. It's pretty so far little bit of blue right here. I don't know how it got there, but it did. But it'll eventually, it'll eventually blend out. So, so far I have the fresh water on and then on top of it I put flip side on. So, there we go. And let me make sure. <laughs> yep, fresh water. Just wanted to make sure. Okay, so then I'm going to put a purple on the outside part. And I'm not sure which purple I am going to use. I think that I am going to use Satellite Dreams by MAC. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to get a little on my brush. And then it's just going to go to the outer corner. I have like a little half and half. I've never used this mirror before either. It's a little interesting. Not my usual cup of tea here. Oh well. 
Hopefully this tutorial will turn out good and it'll get online or it won't turn out good and it won't be online. Yeah, I like that purple with it. I chose the right one. And her look is really pretty because it's just like, it's just this blue and this purple and then like a kind of like a neutral color on the rest of the eye so it's not too much. Okay, do the other eye and we're into five minutes. So I need to hurry a little bit. I'm also going to do a quick cheek and a quick lip as well. And I loved on her, on Tracy, that she did this really bright, bold eye, but she also kept the, the lip and the cheek pretty nude. Just real neutral and light, and I love that. Okay, so we're done with that part. Clean up a little of the excess. Ooh. Okay, so next I'm just going to put Nutty by Wet n Wild. It's a really pretty like, taupey color. I'm going to put that like in the crease with just a regular brush like this. And then that'll keep it pretty, like I said, pretty neutral. Alright, and that's a little darker than I thought it would be, so I'm going to put some other colors on over it. Uh, it's a really pretty, like, taupey, champagne color. I love it. It's gorgeous. Alright, we're in 725. I gotta hurry this up. Okay, I'm going to take my other shadow, um, Sell Out by Urban Decay, and I'm just going to do it all over. I love the way that it toned it down a little and then still put my cell out in the brow bone because it's my favorite brown bone color. I love it. I also like to put it in my inner corner. So you got that, got that. Alright, so then next we're going to do this little tiny color by Sally Girl. It's called, I have no idea, it's like this little bluish greenish color. Put this underneath real quick. I'm going to bring this like halfway in. I'm going to do liner for the rest of it. It's exactly what she, she had some, not the exact shade and product, but she had something of this blue green, like right here underneath on the liner. And then let me get my black liner too. And this one is by Flirt, and I believe it's called Green Expectations. Green expectation, yeah. It's a black, but it has like green in it. And she just had it in the middle like that. So I know this is not the best that I can do, but under the timer restraints, it's good enough. 